Yeah, so welcome uh, on today's lesson. Welcome to Marim Ignatius Wahome YouTube channel for mathematics. And now in our today's lesson, we are going to cover a uh, topic probability. Topic probability uh, that is in form three. And uh, this is a past KCSE question, uh, KCSE 2015. KCSE 2015. There's a two marks question. It's a two marks question. So a two marks question. So let's see uh, what, what the examiner was testing in this question. Now, so the question is here. A nomination committee, uh, a nomination, in a nomination committee, two people are to be selected from a group of three men and five women. Three men and five women. So therefore, find the probability that a man and a woman were selected. A man and a woman were selected. So in this question, you can use a tree diagram to find to work out the to work out this question. And let's see if you have to use a tree diagram to work out this question. So find the probability that a man and a woman were selected. Meaning, in the first place, how many men do we have? We have three men. Women, we have five women. So in total, we have eight people uh, to be uh, in, that, in that committee. So two are to be, uh, two are to be selected uh, from the group of three men and uh, two women. So let's see. If you are to select a man, the first probability being a man, you, you are supposed to put it man, woman, because these two have equal chances, the two. A man and a woman have equal chances of being selected. So the probability of picking the first one being a man. A man is the number of men who are there out of the number, total number of people that are there. So therefore, probability of the first one being a man is 3 out of 8. Probability of a man is 3 out of 8. The probability of the first one being a woman is the, the number of women who are there, 5 out of 8. It's 5 over 8. So this one, probability of the first one being a man, did you write? Probability of the first one being a woman is 5 over 8. So those are the possible outcomes. But you are told two people. You have only selected one. This one option for a man. In the second one, you can put a branch there for a man, woman. If you select a man here, you can select a man or a woman. And if you select in the second branch, a woman first, a woman. Second one, you can select a man. Or a woman a man or a woman now you selected the man being zero byte the probability of the first man being zero byte so the number of men who are remaining now to be selected are two out of how many seven people because there were eight eight people you have selected one being a man so the probability of the second man the second person being a man is two out of seven is two out of seven is two out of seven then, the next option, the probability of selecting the second one being a woman. You selected the first one being a man. So how many are remaining? How many men are remaining? Seven. But you have not selected a woman in this, in this branch. So women are still five out of seven. If you add this branch, two over seven plus five over seven, you get one. Any branch of probability should always give you two. Equals to one. The sum of these two branches should be equals to one. Even this one should give you one. So when you come to this one, the next option of getting this was a woman. You start with a woman here. If the first one was a woman, five over eight, then how many women are, are many? They are many four out of seven because there are eight people. And you have selected one being a woman. So it is four out of seven. What about the men? The first one was a woman. The second one is a man. In this branch, you have not selected a man. Men, we are three. Originally, out of seven, because you selected one being a woman, and that's a tree diagram that two people are selected. Two people are to be selected man, man. So you can put it here man, man. This is man, woman. This is woman, man. Woman, man. And this is woman, woman. So that, that one, you put it like that. So that now you are able to answer the question in a very simple way. 
So with this T diagram, you cannot fit this question. So therefore, find the probability that a man and a woman were selected. So which is the option? Man and a woman. It is this one, man and a woman, or woman, man. It is man, woman, or woman, man. That is the possible outcomes. Not just one. It's not just the order of a man and a woman. It is in any order. Man, woman, or woman, man. So you are not given the instruction, the order to follow. So it is probability that a man and a woman were to be selected. So you can start with a man, woman, or a woman, man. So which are these branch? Take this branch of man, woman, 3 over 8. And the second one is a woman, 5 over 7. You multiply that. Or, or you say woman, man, 5 over 8 times 3 over 7. 3 over 7. So therefore, you can add them. You can multiply this. So 3 times 5, that's 15 over 56. Plus 15 over 56. Then when you add, you get 30 out of 56. If you simplify this, you should simplify this. In the simplest form, by 2, 15, by 2, 28. So the answer is 5 over 28. The answer is 5 over 28. And that's how you do that kind of question on probability. Probability question uh, on uh, that kind of a question. That kind of a question.